Hello guys and welcome to another YouTube video. In today's video I'm going to show you how to record your desktop audio on the MacBook M1 using macOS Big Sur with I show you instant. Of course this will also work for older MacBooks but I want to make this video specially for you guys who are using the new M1 chip because I had big problems finding a way to record desktop audio on my new MacBook Pro. For you guys who are using an older MacBook which doesn't has the M1 chip yet, there will be cheaper ways to record your desktop audio, but which I will also briefly cover in my today's tutorial. So the software I'm going to show you guys today is I show you instant. The thing about I show you instant is that it costs around $25 and there are some other free softwares out there which are able to do the same. But unfortunately they ain't working with the MacBook M1 yet or they didn't work in my case. But I still want to share some of the free ways to record your desktop audio with you guys so you can try out if they will be working on your MacBook. The first way I want to show you guys is with the open broadcast software, short OBS and the I show you audio capture extension. Both of these are free to download and I will put a link to both of those softwares down in my video description. So I would recommend all of you guys to try this way out first because it would be the free way to record your desktop audio. So all you guys will need is to download the OBS software. Once you are done with that you will need to download the I show you audio capture extension. You can check in your system settings under volume and then output if you find I show you audio capture after you downloaded it. As you guys can see I have nothing called I show you audio capture and that is because it didn't work for my new MacBook M1. But if it did work for you guys the only thing you will still have to do is go on OBS then open your settings and go on sound settings. Now choose the desktop audio and switch it down to I show you audio capture. But as you guys can see I have unfortunately no option called I show you audio capture and I tried downloading it at least 10 times. But yeah still try out this option guys it depends on when you are watching the video. I hope once you are watching this video the I show you audio capture is already updated and it's working with the M1 MacBooks too. But if that didn't work for you guys don't worry that's why I want to show you the I show you instant software in my today's video. I show you instant was natively built for the new MacBook M1 and also requires your OS X 10.14.4 or newer. Alright guys so I want to show you now what you can do with the I show you instant audio software. So we will first start with video. With the I show you instant software you can of course only record audio, you can record desktop or you can even record from an iOS device which has to be connected via a lightning cable. But for now I will just want to record from my screen and you can choose full screen application window or a selected area. I just use full screen. Then you can even record a camera. In my time it will be the FaceTime camera from my MacBook. But I will not use that now. Then you have the option to change the frame rate. I usually record on 60 FPS but 30 will be also enough. And you have some more option right here which I find pretty cool. You can for example hide the desktop icons while recording or replace the background with a solid color or a specific image. But I'm usually not using that. Alright so now we're going to the important part for the video which is the audio. Because this video is all about how to capture your desktop audio on the new M1 MacBooks. So as you guys can see when we open audio the first thing which will appear is our application audio. So we can just click it record application audio. And down here we have our microphone. As you guys can see I'm talking right now so this bar is going up and down. And you can choose which microphone you want to use. I'm just using my Yeti stereo microphone. But yeah when you get I show you instant you also have to 
download an extension again but this one goes pretty easy we go to sound and output again and you see I have the SWB audio capture selected at that point what that means is whenever you want to record your desktop audio you have to select the SWB audio capture in your settings so it will be able to record the sound so we can close that again as you can see when I'm talking the volume of my microphone is going up and down so I will just start the YouTube video as you guys can see when I'm starting a YouTube video my volume of the desktop audio is also going up and down which means it's working I would recommend you guys to always check if your settings are right before recording your actual video so just a quick reminder for you guys my video right now I'm filming with QuickTime player so when I was listening to that YouTube video it wasn't the desktop audio you guys heard it was the audio from my headphones so if you guys want to check out how the quality of I show you instant is you can just check out my reaction videos on my YouTube channel they are completely recorded with I show you instant alright guys so that was it with the video I hope I could help some of you guys out with recording your desktop audio on your new MacBook with the M1 chip I remember I had so much trouble doing that so I was like I'm going to upload a video now hopefully helping some of you guys not getting in the same stress like me it took me like five hours at least finding the right software because I tried it on OBS for at least three hours and I was freaking out <laughs> but yeah guys hopefully see you in the next video have a great day bye